everybody. Welcome to Yoga Shorts. My name is Lola. I'm with the Sharon Forks Public Library, a part of the Forsyth County Library System in Georgia, inviting you to take a step away from your busy day, to take a break for yourself, to take an intentional breath, maybe move the body a little bit, and hopefully move back into your day feeling a little refreshed or a little relaxed. So always take care of yourself. If it hurts, don't do it. Um, be sure to follow a doctor's advice if you've been given that, um, and honor your body, uh, whatever um, feels good is best for you. So we'll be doing uh, postures in a chair today. So a nice sturdy chair um, is all that you need, and preferably one without arms. And um, that's all you need. So we'll go ahead and get started. First, let's just take a moment to appreciate that we've been able to take a break for a minute and uh, slow down and put the busyness of the day aside for just a moment. So go ahead and let your feet rest on the floor and um, maybe not leaning back on the back of the chair, but just sitting up tall. Let your hands rest in your lap and go ahead and close your eyes or lower your gaze. And first, just check in with your body. Notice the feet touching the ground. And let your attention travel up your legs and up your spine and check your posture. Make sure you're sitting comfortably upright and tall. And let your shoulders relax away from your ears and let your jaw relax. A quick scan of your face, especially that area around your eyes and let go of any tension you might be holding. And begin to connect with your breath, to notice your natural breath rhythm. Maybe it's the first time today you've been aware of your natural breath. And on your next breath, inhaling, take a little bit deeper inhale right down all the way into the belly. And let that breath go. And we'll take two more breaths like that. A nice deep breath in. And let that one relax out of the body. One more deep breath in. And see if you can exhale a little bit more slowly this final long breath. And let your breath return to its natural rhythm. And then let your eyes come open or refocus. Now first we're just going to move the body a little bit to warm up. So we'll do some seated um, cat cows. First starting with the cow. So we're going to inhale, let the front body open and the head comes up a little bit. And exhale, curl the shoulders, let the belly button come in towards the spine. And inhale, open the front body. And exhale, curl the shoulders in. And one more inhale, open the front body. And exhale, curl the shoulders in. And then inhale back up to center. Let your hands anchor on your thighs and begin to make some gentle circles with the torso. So the pelvis is seated firmly on the chair and the upper body is just moving a little bit, making some circles, waking up a little bit, waking the body up a little bit, and then start to circle the body the other way, getting the spine moving. And then come back to your center position and then let your right hand just drop down beside you. Inhale, let your left hand, arm come up and lean slightly to the right. And then inhale, both arms up overhead. The left arm drops beside you, the right arm comes overhead a little bit. And we'll do that two more times. Each side, overhead, right arm is relaxed down, the left arm comes over. Inhale, back through center. Exhale to the other side, gently. Inhale through center. And exhale to the right. Inhale through the center and exhale to the left. And inhale up and then let the arms come down. So we're going to move into um, a seated um, side angle pose. Um, so what we're going to do is take the right leg and move it out about 90 degrees from the left. So the right leg is sort of hanging over the edge of the chair. I'm going to back up a little bit so 
the bend of the knee is close to the edge of the chair and always be sure your chair is sturdy. I'm seated pretty close to the back of the chair, actually touching the back of the chair a little bit. So make sure you have a solid seat. The first time we do this, we're just gonna keep the legs this way at a 90 degree angle. And the bent leg on the side will be our front leg. So we'll inhale and the arms come up. And then exhale, bend that arm, let it rest on the front leg. The back arm can either come to the hip or it can reach overneath, over, overhead. Um, go with whatever feels right to your body today. And then inhale back up and come back around to the center position. We'll take a breath here in the middle. And then we'll take the other side. So let the left leg hook over to the side of the chair. And this time the right leg is gonna come out um, to the front. But for our purposes, the bent leg over the side, that's gonna be our front leg. So we're gonna be leaning towards that. So inhale the arms up. Exhale, rest that front forearm on that front leg. The upper arm, the back arm can either rest on the hips or it can come overhead. Take a breath here. And then inhale back up and come back to center and let the arms come down. So we've tried that similar position. So option for you to stay with the legs bent as we just did or to straighten the back leg. So you can give it a try and see which one feels more comfortable for your body um, and always go with the one in the version that feels most comfortable to you. So we're gonna let the right leg bend again. I'm gonna scooch a little bit so the bend of this is pretty close to the chair. And this time I'm gonna let the um, left leg come out long beside me. The sole of my foot is actually resting on the ground, pointed out at about between, um, a little bit less than 90 degree angle. So again, this is our front leg. And we're gonna inhale our arms up and then exhale, let that forearm rest on that front leg. Option for the back left arm to rest down or to be on your hip or to come all the way long overhead, whichever feels best to you. And take a breath here, inhaling and exhaling. And then on your next inhale, let this arm come back to hip and then back down. Bend that back leg, bring it back around, and scooch both legs around to the front of the chair. So we'll take a breath here. So we'll move back to the left side, trying it with the, with the right leg long, but you choose whichever feels best to you. If you'd like to keep both legs bent, that's good too. So I'm turning around to the left this time, and I hook my knee pretty close over the chair, and I'll let the right leg go long beside me. The sole of my foot is actually resting on the ground aiming about a little bit less than 90 degrees out. So this is my front leg, the one that's bent over the side. So we're gonna inhale, arms in line with that front leg. Exhale, let the forearm of the left arm rest and option for straight down on the hip or overhead. Honor your body, your shoulders, your back, whichever feels good to you. Take a breath here. And then on the inhale, bring this arm back down, bend the back leg and bring both legs back around to center. And let's take a breath here in the center position, inhaling and exhaling. So we've done a, a seated extended side angle pose today and two options, um, variations with both legs bent, um, about a 90 degree angle between the both legs or extending the back leg with the foot resting on the ground. So give both of these a try and stick with the one that feels best to your body. Multiple arm positions, either on your hips or maybe down by your side, or depending on how your shoulders feel, the arm can come up overhead long, over your head. So thanks for joining me today. I hope that you're doing well. Continue to take time for yourself. Take a moment to take a break and take a breath. I look forward to seeing you next time.